the end of the line for the next half. Thankfully, the damage was light. Maybe wash a bottle. Yeah. Yeah, it smells of detergent. Everybody, is everybody all right in that car? That's his second bit of bad luck. Whose? Well, James's. That's his second car of the day. Yeah. James? Are there any cars you're not going to destroy? James, how many cars have you destroyed today? I didn't destroy it. I'd stopped, as you saw. Every car with which you I saw you driving like an absolute maniac. Shut up. This poor man's days. Classic days here. Anyway, James, uh, as you know, on Top Gear... Yes, goodbye. Thank you. <laughs> Our hunt for the fabled road was not going well. And then it got worse. It went dark, we couldn't find a hotel, the petrol stations were closed, and because Ollie was very low on fuel, I found a quiet, dead-end road and suggested we sleep in the cars. That put James and Richard in a bit of a mood. Listen, I can cheer you two up. Would you like some cannabis? Yes, please. Right. Thanks. Hey? That's cannabis. No, specifically, it says it's... Swiss cannabis iced tea. That's the best sort. You can get this in petrol stations. They sell cannabis in petrol stations, yeah. Would you like some plum liqueur in a bottle the shape of a violin? Say yes. Yes, it's just what the doctor ordered. <laughs> Gives you a oh, fantastic dear. natural feeling. God! Plum liqueur and cannabis. It's <laughs> 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 never been tried before. Kiss and go, it's good. Right, so we sleep in our cars, that's the deal. Yes. I haven't got a back seat. I, I you told you you brought the wrong car. Oh, yes, obviously. When I chose it, I should have thought I'd better get one with a crap back seat. <laughs> Just yeah. get in your car. Well, that's the plum liqueur gone. We set about our unplanned consumer test. So it is a four-seater. They sell it as a four-seater. That must mean a human being can get in the back. Ah! Fault there. People are trying to sleep. I'm going to sleep in the front. Sorry, mate. Oh. You sleep all right? Yeah. Yeah, well. Good. You not use the back? No, I tried. I tried. <laughs> Cold. What's that? It's a dam, but it's all right. It's quite safe. I should imagine it was built by the Russians or the North Koreans, so it would be fine. Had I known... Sorry, mate, with... Well, you parked us next to that. I wouldn't have enjoyed such deep sleep. Damn. No, the quality of all Soviet buildings is fantastic. I'm sure that'll be... Why don't you shut up? We set off once more in search of our road. Soon we reached the mountains where the road surface became as pimply as a teenager's face. Look at the road now, it's practically ploughed. This was yet another problem for James in his supercar. Oh, please let it end. The torture went on for hours, but eventually, the mountains gave up their secret. Look! God! <laughs> That's the most amazing road I've ever seen. Built in the 70s, this is the Transfiguration Highway. 
6,000 tons of dynamite were used to make it, and 40 lives lost. But from above, it looks like every great corner from every great racetrack in the world has been knitted together to create one unbroken grey ribbon of automotive perfection. city centres and gypsy villages. They'd been slept in and written on, but now they had a chance to let their hair down. Oh, that's heavenly. That traction control now in the setting that allows a little bit of slip. But here, on this road, the happiest bunny of us all was James. I brought the right car. Lamborghini payback time. Oh, yeah. to say this is one of the two or three best cars in the world right now. And the strange thing is, those two are driving, two of the others. The road just got better and better. We were wrong! This is better than the Stelvio! This is the best road in the world! And the Romanian helicopter cameraman wasn't bad either. Oh, ho, ho. what a finale to our grand tour. Just want to say, Romania, thank you for having us. And can we stay forever? Oh.